Good morning, good afternoon, good evening guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers, my name is Didi, and I guess you know I like some Bitcoin, look my beautiful cap, the, B, the, B, the beautiful shirt all over the place, guys, hmm, a cool TA video about what I see on the Bitcoin charts, but also some really cool charts um, about yeah, like the fundamentals of Bitcoin, like we're, we're gonna show you everything, we, me and my other personality. Um, probably gonna record another video today as I had a kick-ass barbecue yesterday with two amazing Bitcoiners, um, which made me think about something I want to talk about with you. But that video I will be creating today, later or tomorrow. Now quickly jump into those charts. Back. This is the first one. This is the four hour chart. Um, I need to be very clear to you guys. Yes, I have a trading portfolio. Yes, I have a holo portfolio. And, and I can understand that on the trading portfolio, people are freaking out, you know, stressing out. So that's why I created that BAM indicator for those people that want to trade, but you know, need some tools to be able to call the longs and the shorts, buy and sell. Now. I told you yesterday we had a long flag and I told you uh, we had a closing but there was a lot of blue. We need green. So here another candle closed above the yellow stepping line. The BAM crossed that midline and there was a lot of green without blue. That is the moment to take that long. That is the moment you have a triple confirmation and you have 8.4% profit. Now, for those that don't want to freak out um, about these uh, small time frames, I'm going to slowly zoom out a little bit. Now, the first one is this one, the weekly. On the weekly, we can see at the moment that um, we have still a higher low, but I'm waiting for the band to give me a long flag, which can still take a few weeks. If you look at the structure over here, the red needs to become thin. That becomes thin because the weekly is going sideways. And then, at a certain moment, it becomes a long flag with this green cloud. So, we should be going sideways, a little bit up and down, and then we get that green cloud. That is how I look at the weekly. And that's still, in my opinion, a small, short-term time frame. And if you zoom out even way more, then you understand what I'm saying. Like, now we zoom out to the monthly. On this monthly, you can see these huge peaks. This is the peak of 2014. Maybe I need to draw them. Peak 2014. Peak 2017. Not really a peak at the moment still. Um, but you can see how this looks on a logarithmic growth curve chart. If you look at this in an other way, to be able to understand that you just need to keep buying Bitcoin, I would need to open this chart. Because on this chart, you will see that this was that 2014 peak. And when 2017 created a new peak, this was nothing anymore. It was a very small hump in the chart. So the 2017 peak, I said to you that that moment, that is going to look like the 2013 peak. And during this bull run, during that this bull run unfolded, what do we see? To see the whole peak at the moment, look, that 2070 peak is not that big anymore. It's small. 2013 you don't see anymore. So this peak that we see now, I need to make this one, sorry, 2020, uh, let's say 2032 peak. This peak will in the future, in my opinion, also look like that peak, nada. Because I believe that if we get a blow of top, like above 100k, and if we go four years further, then this four years further, the peak will be above 100k, all the way to maybe even here, like 
let's just draw something we get a blow of top we get a little we go down and we come down and we go up in that new peak then this peak again will also look like nada after four years this also will become a small peak again that is what i believe that bitcoin will do in the long term so freaking out in the short term is nice if you're a trader but if you believe in bitcoin in the long term you should just be buying bitcoin every day dca dollar cost average now here <clears throat> this is the Puel multiple and the Puel multiple is very simple to understand if you're near the green part you buy if you're in the pinkish part you sell you can see that we are moving up with the bottoms this was the bottom over there and then we went up with the bottom a little bit uh, to 0 0.4 then you end up with the bottom a little bit to 0 0.8 now the bottom over there is 0 0.82 so we are moving up i want to see this yellow line touch or go into this pinkish area and we will probably see that when this blow of top happens so this one is an indication to for me to get out that's why i didn't get out yet now the mvrv zeke score same green beautiful buy opportunity pink beautiful sell opportunity we are still creating higher levels yes we went into it just like we went into it here in 2013 14 twice now one time maybe we will make another one that is what i'm waiting for also here if you look at this the number of new addresses in a bear market mostly there are not there is no uptrend in new addresses look the amount of new addresses created daily is still in an uptrend it's not crashing down it's still every day there is like 2,900,000 new addresses created it's wallets bitcoin wallets that's not like a bear trend that's like a lot of people still want to get into bitcoin and then if you uh, look at the total amount of addresses you can see that there is a steep growth in this here all the way up to the like 930 million addresses already on the bitcoin blockchain so this doesn't look like a bear market to me and that is what i said to you in the previous videos before i see a lower low on the weeklies on the monthlies and i see the breaking of a logarithmic growth curve of the gaussian channel all of that i'm not calling it a bear market yes it is a bearish trend at the moment but that's not a bear market to me a bear market is like one to two years downwards movement in bitcoin i don't see this yet hope this was a little bit clear if you did enjoy the video give the video a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and yes leave a comment and yes do watch my second video today as well um, i still need to record it but i think it will be a very insightful video for people that doubt bitcoin Thanks for watching and see you tomorrow again.